Hi, I'm Seb from Groundology and in this video I'm going to show how domestic electricity and appliances such as laptops and computers etc induce voltage in the human body and how grounding can help with this. So this kind of test is very easy to do. All you need is a uh, reasonably sensitive digital voltmeter or multimeter. And the one that we're using here is the one that we sell on the Groundology website. It retails for uh, around £30 so it's quite an inexpensive piece of kit and we've got it set here to uh, AC voltage so uh, this is important because the type of voltage which EMF induces is AC voltage so uh, the um, setting on this meter here is indicated by a V with a wavy line on, on other meters it might say VAC or ACV and we've got it set here on the range 20 which means it will read up to 20 volts that's a, a reasonably good starting point for doing body voltage readings now we're measuring the body with reference to earth so the uh, the common or com port of the meter is connected to earth via this cable and this crocodile clip which just clips into the second terminal on uh, an earth connection plug such as you'd get with any piece of grounding or earthing equipment and then on, on the other end is just the standard probe test probe and uh, it's got a metal tip and I'm going to just squeeze that in, in the fingers of my hand and that uh, will now show that my body voltage reading on the screen. So you can see there uh, I've got about two and a quarter volts, 2.25 volts in my body. Um, yeah, this is not um, too bad, you know, it could, could be worse. Uh, we're, in, we're in a reasonably uh, isolated situation here. It's, it's uh, you know a single building in the middle of the woods, uh, no power lines nearby, most of the things in this building are, are turned off. So this is literally just from the electricity cables running through the wall and, and from this small laptop that's a couple of feet away from me over here. Now uh, watch what happens when I uh, put my hand nearer to this laptop. As you can see I'm still you know two or three inches away from the laptop and it's almost up to four volts. If I put my hand actually on the laptop you can see it goes up to about 13 volts. If I take the laptop and actually put it on my lap you can see in fact it's gone right off the scale. I'm just going to put this up to the next range up and uh, you can see now it's, it's re reading over 20 volts having this laptop resting on my, on my lap. So it just indicates how it's the proximity to the electricity which uh, you know re really increases the body voltage reading so you know if for example you know you've got electricity cables you know running running next to your bed in the walls uh, you know you're going to have quite a lot of uh, volts in, in your body um, this, you know which is one of the reasons why it's so important to sleep grounded um, so let me show you now what happens if I uh, put my hand on this grounding mat that I've got on the desk I'll just start by putting one finger on the mat and you can see with one finger it drops you know almost to zero 0 0.3 0.4 if I put my whole hand on the mat then there we go it's dropped completely to zero so uh, you know it's near as 0 0.1 so it's a little tiny bit of voltage but really really uh, you know nothing to speak of considering that I've got a laptop uh, directly on top of my lap. So this is the way that you know, I generally like to use computers. I, I will uh, have a mat under my keyboard. If whilst I'm typing, I'll rest my wrist on the mat. Whilst I'm using the mouse, again, my wrist is resting on the mat. And uh, yeah, that just keeps the voltage right down, as, as you can see on, on the screen there. And you know, the same is true for using an earthing sheet. You know, if, you, if you're in bed on an earthing sheet, you know, you, you know that your body voltage is going to be virtually zero. Anyway, I hope you found this video useful. If you want to find more information, more details about how to do a body voltage reading, then uh, you can always download the user guide to this meter, which is in the, uh, the products accessory section on our website. Thanks for listening. Bye for now.